felt like roller coaster. Obviously, how what was your was opinion? it ever? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Obviously, a slow start to the game, and you know, we we knew they were going to come out. I mean, we came out of their building real hard in the first period, and. They did the same tonight, but they kept it going for the first, the full 20 minutes, and you know we got behind obviously, and I had a lot of trouble. So I'm proud of my team. We bounced back and we played hard the rest of the game, and it's unfortunate, but uh, you know that's the way she goes, and we'll get back at them again next game. What do you attribute that slow first? Game? I have no idea. It's <laughs> stuff happens. You prepare the same way, you get them ready to play the same way, and like I said, the, the fans definitely help in every building. So. It was no different than what it was in our building in the first games. You know, we had a great start to the game. We had great forechecking, and you know they got a couple of fortunate bounces. You know, they played well. They dominated the first, but after that, uh, I thought we played really well. It felt like you guys had looks, but maybe you were giving up too many at the same time. First period. Yeah. After that, yeah. I think we were the. I mean, you, you watched the game. I mean, that power play. We had great saves, and look, you got to give Louis Dumain credit. When it was four four, he made two or three great saves in our power play. So, you know, that was a big part of the game. Igor's been so unbelievable, beyond unbelievable to you. Yeah. I mean, you sit him down there, it's just, just Yeah, you know, you look at it and you say, you know, I mean, again, two of them were lucky bounces, and, you know, it's 4 1. You want to change momentum a little bit sometimes, and Igor has been outstanding. And really, you look at it right now, and he's played 10 periods in the last basically four, four and a half days, five days, whatever it is. So I thought it was a good time to, you know, jump start it. And, Fortunately for us, we battled back in the second and tied it up. And unfortunately, in the third, they got a goal. So, but I, I, I like the way our team didn't quit. That was proud of them for that, and we'll be ready to go next game. Did you have much of a, of a message for them in between those first and second periods? It was just man up. You know, it's, it's uh, you know, they're they're a good team. We're playing over there, but there's no difference. The, the ranks are the, the same length. The same, you know, you got to go and play the game, and let's man up and be men about this. And uh, we're not going to die. We're not going to sit that back and let them continue to play like that against us. And you know, we came out and we caught them pretty good, and uh, we battled back in that hockey game. I, if I'm understanding correctly, part of the motivation for going to Georgia was switching momentum, but also maybe to get Igor off, like off his feet for a little bit and give him a little more rest. Yeah, exactly. Work. Yeah. I mean, like I said, it's four-one. <laughs> it was totally tilted. Yeah. And. Sometimes you spark your team with a goalie change. Eko has been our MVP all season, as everybody knows, and, and in the playoffs. So I thought we'd give him a little rest tonight and uh, hopefully spark our team, and it worked. You know? What did you think of Georgiev? What's that? What did you think of Georgiev? I thought he's really solid. Really, he looked strong. He was excited to get in there, and he's really solid.